more severe weather slamming parts of the U.S. A powerful system leaving a path of destruction near Kansas City. A series of tornadoes spotted in the region overnight. Twisters tearing roofs off homes, leveling buildings, uprooting trees, and downing power lines. Residents waking up to widespread damage today. Weather stranding passengers at Missouri's Kansas City International Airport. Travelers there forced to find shelter in parking garage tunnels as the storms pass the airfield. We heard the overhead announcement and they said, everybody out of the terminal, let's go downstairs. Everybody needs to be safe. We're glad that the, um, the tunnels exist, right? Um, it's the first time I've ever had to go through something like that. The latest rash of tornadoes came a day after twisters hit western Ohio, leaving at least one person dead and several others hurt and leaving neighborhoods in ruin. The Ohio Department of Transportation using snow plows to clear highways of debris. An unusual wave of extreme weather has brought more than 300 tornadoes to the U.S. Midwest in just the last two weeks. There's a road underneath here. Somewhere. Other areas like parts of Arkansas dealing with other challenges. Floodwaters here continue to rise. Some houses nearly submerged. Forecasters are warning that the waters may take weeks to recede as heavy rains upriver continue to drain. A brief break from the powerful storms is expected in a stretch of the U.S. that's been hammered recently. But according to forecasters, another round of extreme conditions is expected to hit early next week.